on a Friday leading to a holiday weekend where many people couldn't wait to get away. For some, they had to wait a little longer. The truck never rolled, just the trailer and the equipment. Standing along SR-201 isn't where Mark Gaddy wanted to be after work. No. But he figured but he had to. It was our mistake, so we went ahead and cleaned it all up. Gaddy works for the company that was involved in an accident right where SR-201 meets I-215 and where traffic was so backed up. One of our drivers was coming down the exit, coming down and then a car cut in front of him, so he turned real hard. And when he turned, the trailer flipped, spilling heavy equipment, gouging a 20-foot wide cut six inches deep in the pavement. But get this, the truck belonged to Morgan Pavement, and the company had a load of asphalt mix nearby on another project. So we just swung over here and started asphalting it. Using their own product. Now the freeway won't have to be shut down overnight. Which UDOT says would have been the case since asphalt plants are closed for the weekend. You guys want water? It may have been one of the fastest fixes ever to get that holiday traffic moving again. I think it's only been an hour, literally. 